Using direct integration, find the area of moment of inertia about the midline of the rectangle with the base B and the height H. So I want to take a horizontal axis. I'm looking for IX. By definition, that's the integral of Y squared DA. To do the DA, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a horizontal differential element. So in my rectangle, I'm going to look at some bit which has thickness dy and length b because the whole thing is h. The area of my differential area, which would be dA, is going to be b times dy. I can plug that in. ix is the integral of y squared times b dy. My limits of integration are going to be from negative h over 2. That's where y starts, to h over 2. If you take the integral, you get the y cubed over 3 times b from h over 2 and negative h over 2. You can plug that in. Because you've got two negatives and that one's cubed, that's going to be a positive number. So I've got bh cubed over 24 plus bh cubed over 24. ix for a rectangle about its midline is bh cubed over 12. 1 12th bh cubed.